Hey guys, today I wanted to go over how to estimate ranges to targets using mills. So, I've got two targets to try this out on just to show you that it works. One is the officer located there in the center of the screen. Another is an officer located, let me go ahead and pull up my scope here, basically up on this road here, so pretty decent distance away. So basically, if you look through your scope here, right, you'll see these little dots. These dots are used to basically estimate mills. So between one dot to another, that is equal to one mill. A full dot in itself is basically 0.2 mills. And essentially, if you're going from the center of one dot to the bottom of another dot, that's about 0.8 mills. So in order to do this, you have to know the approximate height of the uh, target that you're looking to estimate the range to. In this case, it's a man-sized target. So you can clearly see here. So I'm going to use 1.7 meters as an estimation. So basically that's the average height of a human male in North America. So we'll go ahead and uh, get started with this estimation. So the equation you're going to do is basically your target height. So in this case 1.7 multiplied by 1000. That gives us basically simplified to 1,700, and that's going to be divided by the number of mils that the target takes up in your scope. So looking at that real quick, what I like to do is take the center illuminated dot there, basically look up from foot to head. So got one mil, two mil, looks like about two and a half mils. Two and a half, maybe 2.4, 2.45, something around there. So I'm going to go ahead and do the math. So 1,700 divided by, let's say, uh, actually looking at it again, that's probably more like 2.2, 2.3. We'll go 2.25 to be safe. And that's given me 755 meters. So we'll go ahead and do a range finder, check the range, see what we're looking at. So that's 782 meters, so basically from that estimation, I'm about 30 meters off from my target, but that's not too bad. Again, as you do this more, you'll get better at estimating range to target and determining the number of mils uh, that they take up. So what's also important too that I want to mention as well with this equation, whatever value you're using, basically meters, inches, centimeters, yards, whatever else that you're using for basically your target height, that is going to be what the answer is given to you in. So in the case of ARMA 3, obviously you want to use meters. So go ahead, find this other officer up on the road here. There he is. So in this case, a little bit further, so as before, going to go ahead line the mill reticle at the very bottom of him. Look at this here. That's about, okay, 1, 1 1.4, 1 1.5, let's say 1.45 in this case. So 1,700 divided by 1 1.45, that gives me 1,172 meters. Let's go ahead and check that with the laser rangefinder here. Move in, ping the target, and got 1,197, so I'm basically about 20 and some change off, around 25. So, as you can see, this is a pretty useful method of estimating your range to your target. Um, obviously, it's more for those long-range precision shots, but hey, hopefully you got something out of this, hopefully you enjoyed it, and hopefully you learned something.